So this is the second half, which uh, I know some of you in this room know the new project that we're doing, and I have a Pledge Music campaign going on right now to, to make it happen, and this is obviously a very big part of the creation stage, but we're going to turn part of the songs from the first half into an EP. This section of it is uh, everyone is going to see. That first half was just for Pledge Music folk, so um, we're going to do some new songs. Thank you. 
Leo Pio on that saxophone, that baritone saxophone, everybody. Man, Leo is such an inspiration, and I tell you, today is like the, one of the very few days that he's not on tour. He's like on tour until August, just like all over the place, so he's become quite the brother to me and such an inspiring cat, so thank you, Leo.
Give it up for Eliza and Barry. Uh, active or passive or? It's active. Yeah, keep yeah, keep playing the. Wow. I'm gonna tell you guys a little story about the song before we start it. So, um, last summer uh, we were doing a lot of touring in Europe. My band, we had an amazing time in Italy and Germany. We were there for like two months, and then. Um, came home to New York in June, and I had been kind of on and off dating, had been on a fair amount of bad dates. D not bad, disappoint, I don't know. Just like, <laughs> a little more to be desired dates, I guess. And, um, but it was late June, and uh, I was talking to this guy, and we decided to meet up, um, and he picked a spot in the East Village, and it was called Grain and grape, grape and grain, something like that, yeah. And um, we were talking a bunch before online and texting and I was getting really excited because he just seemed so great. And we met at five o'clock, which is like happy hour time. I don't know why we met then, but, um, and happy we basically, yeah, happy That's hour, why you met I guess, <laughs> yeah. And we basically like walked into each other because we were both on time, which is very unusual for me. <laughs> And there was nobody there, and it was like the cutest place, had a wood everywhere, and there was this booth, and so we were in the booth, and then we were eating, and I felt like butterflies immediately when I, when we walked into each other, and then I got really nervous, and then we were eating and talking, and then it was five o'clock, six o'clock, seven o'clock, eight o'clock, and then we went to another spot, and all of a sudden it was midnight, and then we spent the next few weeks just journeying around New York and doing things I'd never done, even though I've been visiting the city since I was really little. And we took the Staten Island Ferry, thanks to Carly's recommendation. Hey. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> and we were going to museums and just like going to so many coffee shops and just having the greatest adventures, and we still do. And he got back from Berlin yesterday. It's my boyfriend, Pasha, standing. Um, and your lady's here. Yeah. Oh. I, I, I feel like I'm not prepared to tell <laughs> an, an in-depth story about the beginning of my relationship, but it's a very nice one. I can From tell. The best one I've ever had. Oh, okay, I won't put you on this one. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm so happy to meet you. Um, I'm so glad you're here. And I'm so glad you're all here. Anyways, so I was like, it was a few weeks into a relationship and I'm sitting at home and I'm like completely in a daydream, just like feel like I'm floating on a love cloud. And then um, I wrote the song. And you know that feeling when just everything feels so right and you feel like you're at home and you just, that person makes you feel so at home. You know that feeling, right? Yeah, so. Uh, I wrote a song called Feels Like Home and I'm so happy Elliot's here singing it with me. Do we have the session pulled up? Okay. It, up. it was it was perfect and I just like in that moment I was like see this is just a testament to great songwriting and great no, you know what I'm like, saying I just lost myself just like I was making, in it. you were just I was making like, us wait I know I almost came thing. in too I was like this is like the most emotional pause 
it'll be it'll be better, yeah, and, yeah, and then we'll continue with the I'm, song. I'm having the time of my life. <clears throat> ooh, I just ooh felt it. Amazing Thank song. You. Grace Kelly, everybody. Aww. It's crazy. Like music, like gives you that. Like I'm a kind of person that doesn't. I feel like it's it's hard to. For me, it's hard to um, like say how I feel all the time. Me too. And like music is that mm. like for me a lot. Me too. Um, and this this is just a great song. And I'm really glad I had never heard that story before. Uh, I didn't realize this I was never about. Never told it. Right. Oh, yeah. hey. So maybe I'm just too emotional right now. I, I had a I had a conversation with a friend once, a musician friend, and he was just saying how <clears throat> is that feeling like when you're. I don't know, we express on our, our instruments and voices, and he was like, some days I wish I could just, like, go up to the person I, and just, like, riff on the guitar. Right. And just, like, play, right. and, like, to my wife when we're having an argument, and just be like, meh! Because it's just, like, right. be so much easier. Yeah. Yeah. Because talking is, like, it's, oh, God. It's hard. <laughs> <laughs> Things don't come out right. Like, I agree. Yeah. It's a lot. Talking is a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> You know what I mean? Not just move your fingers to a mode, you know? And that's easier. All right, let's do it again. Okay. 
kisses chase like sunshine You tell me I'm so bright Oh, you feel like home You feel like home On a starlit summer night You're the drumbeat of my heart I thought that was tight. That was I think, beautiful. Um, yeah. we, we could do it just to have it. Can we just do one that's just acoustic? Why am I asking you? We're going to do one that's just acoustic. I'm like, hey, guys, can we? All right. Let's, yeah, let's just take cool. Let's have yeah. it. Cool. I think it'd be great. You want to do that one without the clip? Yeah, without the clip. Yeah. You want to do pad? No. If you, I mean. Mm, if you feel it. We can always strike you, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's true. Right. So if you feel, yeah. that's cool. <laughs> it's like after, after, like we sing the song, I have to like start over emotionally. I know. Because I just feel like <laughs> emotionally re- like. Re meet. <laughs> oh, am I on the verge of crying? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's been an emotional day. <laughs> Something more I cannot say Maybe this time It could be love Cause you feel Like home When I look Into your eyes Your kisses taste like Sunshine You tell me I'm so bright Oh you feel Darling summer night You're 
the drumbeat of my heart You're loving red as white Oh, you feel like home Suddenly I'm falling a thousand stories high It's too late to turn back now So I'll look deep into your eyes You pull me close Kiss me softly under the city lights Somewhere in there I fell in love You feel like home When I look into your eyes Your kisses taste like sunshine Thank you for singing on my song. Yeah, thank you for and having me. playing. One more time, everyone. Elliot Skinner. Uh, Joe, am I good to unplug? Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I think we got covered. Yeah. Guys, we got one more. I'm going to take a little breather.
is in the next room. So we'll see you there. Thank you so much. Thank you. We did it! Yes! How do you feel, Grace? I am literally so happy and so worn out and sweating so hard because that was the full, full set. And we had like a lot of guests and we had like little breaks in between to reset, but the audience was awesome. The band freaking rocked it. We had a long day just like rehearsing and we've been going since 11 a.m. and it's almost 11 p.m. But that is a wrap. Yes!